Harper, speaking on Barbados radio program, Mason and Guess, was questioning which areas of the team he would look to strengthen and find those players in the CPL. West Indies had an 18-man squad which they used early in the year for their four home series, but some players underperform, which leaves eyes on the CPL for possible replacements. I, I'm trying not to get too specific with certain things here, you know, but I think that um, there are a few areas that we will pay a little more attention to because um, I think the, the backup wicket keeping spot is one definitely that, um, you know, we're still looking at. But um, there are other areas as well. Like I said, players have the opportunity to really demand a place because most of the players in that squad, if not all of them, will be playing in the CPL as well. So they have an opportunity to really okay. show us what they can do and say that they deserve a place in the squad. Harper re-emphasized the importance of players performing well in the CPL, which commenced Thursday in St. Kitts and Nevis. CPL is important for a, a number of reasons. I still think that, uh, you know, players have uh, an opportunity just before the team is selected to remind us of what they can do. Mm. And, uh, you know, places that would be up for consideration, players have an opportunity to really make a stake a claim. Mm. So the CPL is very important. As a matter of fact, it gives players the opportunity of getting in some competitive cricket leading into, well, there's still the IPL to follow the CPL, but, you know, all leading into the, to the World Cup. Success against Sri Lanka and Australia and losses to South Africa and a rain-hit Pakistan tour, Harper still said he has seen some encouraging signs from the 20 players. You know, there's some very encouraging signs from the team. I think when we look at the, the players we have in the squad, you know, it's, it, it, it's a list of very powerful players. Now we have to convert those powerful, talented players mm. into a world-beating team, right? And, you know, once we do that, once we, we, we are able to convert them into a world-beating team where they do the simple, smart things when they need to and play for each other and complement each other, you know, and work together, then I think, you know, we'll be a very difficult team to beat in any conditions by any opposition. West Indies only side to win the tournament twice will feature an opening day of the Super 12s as they kick off their defense of the title in Dubai against England on October 23. For the newsroom, Akin Green.